The backlash against the Trump administration over all of this is growing louder this morning. Abigail James explains how Trump's zero tolerance policy differs from the ways President Bush and President Obama treated immigration families. Abigail. Well, a new CBS poll says 67% of Americans say that it is unacceptable to separate children from their parents at the border. So why is this happening? Well, some White House officials have created confusion over the policy's origin. At one point saying it was a simple decision of the administration to have a zero tolerance policy for illegal entry, but then also saying it was Congress that made illegal entry a crime. And recently, President Trump tweeted that Democrats have, quote, forced the law upon our nation, end quote. From late April to the end of May, almost 2,000 children were torn from their parents, facing a misdemeanor for illegally crossing into the U.S. Neither the Obama or the Bush administration split up the families at the border. President Bush also had zero tolerance, but families with children were exempt from enforcement. President Obama's team set on, on expanding the detention of immigrant, immigrant families by adding more facilities where they could wait for their administrative cases to be processed. Now, Homeland Security Secretary Christian Nielsen says the administration won't apologize for enforcing the law. For now, reporting live, Abigail James, KCTV5 News.